Now, Dave, um, IML, tell me a little bit about your company. Um, it goes back 21 years now. Myself and Jerry have been in partnership. Uh, we've gone from working in a little backyard into um, working where we are now. And what type of sectors have you been working in specifically over the years? Uh, over the past 21 years, there's not a sector we haven't worked in, really. Uh, we specialise now in a lot of uh, manifold, manufacturer, aircraft, seating, medical, and a little bit of defence. Dave, so I've noticed that some of your parts here, they're really complex. It's not just general subcontracting work you're doing. No, a lot of the parts we make are very sort of high spec, um, and we try and do as much of that as possible now. That's the type of work that we're trying to um, concentrate on now. You've got turning, you've got milling, uh, but obviously you've got the jewel, which is this system here. Can you tell us a little bit about it? Yeah, we originally bought this system for high volume production work. Um, but pretty much from the first week we found it and got it, we realised it's actually brilliant for prototype work as well. So is it lights out engineering effectively? It is, yeah. It's pretty much lights out, yeah. Not only that as well now, if we get a rush job come in, a prototype, we can just slide that in. And while it's making the prototype and it's finished the prototype, while it's in inspection, the machine is making something else. So the machine doesn't stop. While it's being checked for maybe 10, 12 hours, the machine is still making something else. So there's no downtime, which means less cost for our customer. And how long has this system been in place? Uh, this machine has been in place now for about uh, four or five months now. And are, are you looking at sort of uh, further expansion for, for the company? We had this machine installed for one week and realised this is the way to go forward and we've already placed an order for a second one. And obviously the, the, you, you're working with the YMT and the YMC machines and Aroa here. Do they look after the whole system for you? From start to finish, yeah. They installed everything about it, they maintain it. I can make a phone call and have an engineer within it been hours, but to be honest with you, since it's been installed, we haven't required it. It's just ran from the day it got installed. Uh, we're here because of uh, Vero, Edgecam. Now, Edgecam is a big part of your business. Could you tell us how you use it, how you integrate with it? We've had Edgecam now for probably about 12 or 15 years. Uh, when we first bought Edgecam many years ago, we just used it for doing just small, complex parts of the program that we couldn't possibly program, and the rest of it was done the original long-handed way. 15 years later, we pretty much do all of our programming on it now. I would say about 90 to 95% of our programs are produced on EdgeCam. And even if we're not supplied with a model now, we actually produce our own step file from the drawing. And then from that uh, model, we then create a program using EdgeCam. There's no way that you could actually operate without EdgeCam then? No. And to be honest with you, most of our parts that we make are so complex, it would be impossible to program without EdgeCam. You, you really got some massive investment here. You've, you've got a second unit uh, system coming in as well. Um, will you be doing more with EdgeCam? Oh, without a doubt, yeah. EdgeCam is just a well, way forward for us. We couldn't function without EdgeCam nowadays. So, with EdgeCam, have you got any examples of how complex the system could work for you? Yeah, I mean, as you can see now, the machine, both machines are operating 24 7. Um, we received an order from a customer. They received a model for this part here on Friday about 11 o'clock in the morning. Um, they asked us if we could make these parts um, and we made it straight away. We could just put it in the robot, uh, a block of metal goes in like that and it comes out on one operation like that. So therefore we turn this component round on a weekend. So we received the model on the Friday and by the Monday morning they received the finished component over a weekend. And once it finished making this, it then carried on making the production work. So even though we made a prototype, the machine hasn't stopped. Lights out engineering for you guys. You're saving a lot of money, re referencing time. It's working over the weekends. It's growing your business. Would you like to expand even further? Oh yeah, this is the way forward about a doubt. There's a lot, I remember many years ago, we bought our first tool changing machine and realized that having an automatic tool changing machine was a way forward. This is another one of those moments. Without one of these machines, we wouldn't be able to compete, I don't think, in the future. And obviously without EdgeCam, there's no way that this could run efficiently as it does. No, they work hand in hand together.